Hey guys, and thanks for joining me for yet another video. In this presentation, we're going to be making mango talcari. Now, mango talcari is a nice side condiment that goes really well with any curry dish that you're enjoying. It's a sweet and savory flavor, more so on the sweet side. <laughs> but join me and I will take you through all the steps of achieving this great side dish condiment. Let's go. Hey guys, and thanks for joining me for yet another video. In this presentation, we are going to be preparing mango talcari. Now, mango talcari is more so considered an Indian dish. Uh, lots of Indian flavors to bring this thing to life. I'm definitely going to be walking you through the steps of, a, of accomplishing this meal. So in this recipe, I'm going to be using four average sized mangoes, not very big. They're pretty small. And we're also going to be using one small onion, which mounts up to be about one cup of minced onion. I have some Spanish thyme that's finely minced. Uh, if you're using the regular thyme, I would say about a tablespoon of that grounded. We're going to be using some hot sauce, some green seasoning, a bit of minced garlic and ginger, a touch of salt. We're going to be using a bit of cooking oil, some amchar masala, some curry powder and some jeera powder. You're also going to need about a cup of sugar. I'm using white sugar in this case. So the first step, I already washed these mangoes. I'm going to chop them up with the skin on as finely as possible. I'm also going to be removing the seed that's in the core of this mango and I'll be back to show you the sizes that we're gonna be using for this recipe. Yeah guys, so I got my mango chopped as nicely and as finely as I could. Some nice little pieces of chopped mango here. So what we're gonna do is we are going to start by putting some of this oil into our pot. We're gonna put our stove on medium high heat and we're going to be putting about two tablespoons of cooking oil in the middle there and we're gonna allow that to heat up and then After three minutes of the oil heating up we're going to be adding our onions and Spanish thyme to it we're gonna allow these two items to cook for three minutes which will indeed make your onions caramelize so it's been about three minutes and our onions got a chance to caramelize on a medium high heat so now we're gonna go in proceeding to season this so what we're gonna do is we're gonna go in with one teaspoon of minced garlic half a teaspoon of minced ginger with half a teaspoon of curry tablespoons of uh, amchar masala half a teaspoon of hot sauce and we're gonna give this a mix so we're gonna keep stirring this for a total of three minutes just to make sure these flavors you know they get going and they burst open and to, to give us what we need we're gonna be going in with a half cup of hot water next so now's a good time to make sure your hot water is on standby because in about two minutes from now we're gonna be throwing it into this mixture and making our paste so it's been about three minutes of us cooking our masala with our other ingredients so now is the time where we're going to add in our half cup of water and we're going to just stir this into it we're going to get this into a thick enough paste this is going to turn into like a more of a thicker paste so after getting our sauce to a nice consistency it's nice and thickened up so you can see there's much water in there so now what we're gonna do is we're gonna toss our mango into this so we're gonna add our mango into the pot and we're gonna give it a mix to make sure all our mango is covered in this paste before we proceed to the next step. So now that all our mango is covered in our paste, nicely covered, it's coated in it, what we're going to do is we're going to add one teaspoon of salt to this, followed by our cup of sugar, 
and then I'm gonna give it a toss so that the mango kind of takes that in right away and then once you mix in the salt and the um, sugar onto the mango like this you see it's starting to caramelize and turn into a paste already but now we're gonna submerge this mango in water up till the contents of the mango so we're gonna submerge the mango now so to not change the temperature in the pot I usually go in with hot water that's already been boiled so mind you we're just submerging our mango so we're gonna put enough water in here to make sure the mango is totally underneath like this not too much just enough so that all our mango gets a chance to sit in the water so what we're gonna do now is we're gonna cover this down and allow this to cook for at least 20 minutes hey so it's I'm been about 30 minutes of having our mango cooked i'm gonna allow it to cook for a total of 40 minutes before i turn it off the mango seed is just about as delicate as i like however i do believe a 10 more minutes would enhance the thickness of the sauce as well as the um you know the seed of the mango that's in there so we'll be back to check this in 10 minutes so we'll be a total of, it's been a total of 40 minutes i'm just gonna turn my stove off right now and uh yeah this is pretty much done what we're gonna do now is as you know we didn't add in two of our last ingredients one being green seasoning i'm gonna add one heaping teaspoon of green seasoning to this as well as a teaspoon of jeera powder and we're gonna mix that in and what that's gonna do is it's gonna add that it's gonna bring the flavor up a notch you know because it's been cooking for a while so a lot of the flavors that we put in at the beginning they cooked into the mango now so the green seasoning it gives it that final touch so what i'm gonna do this is completely ready so i'm gonna take this off the heat i'm gonna put hey it into so i'm just back with this talcari uh it's all complete nice tender you know and it tastes good too it's pretty hot right now now takari is good with any form of curry dish that you could think of so yeah you can put this as a side with any curry any curry dish that you could think of it's a great side so yeah i hope you enjoyed this video and i hope you make it